But my concern is, let's go back to the Obama-Biden administration. And when you look at, you have to look at and be careful about who is, uh, think about, uh, we have to, and whether it's Trump or uh, Vice President Biden who wins, we have to be concerned about who they appoint. Um, President Obama appointed Jane Lubchenco, uh, who came from the Environmental Defense Fund and, you know, who I, on a personal relation, on a personal basis, had a good relationship with. But people- To, to run NOAA, right? Mm -hmm. Right, I'm sorry, to run the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, a component of which is the National Marine Fisheries Service, also known as NOAA Fisheries, which oversees our, our fisheries in the United States. Um, dark, the, con the concern is that people, people who are appointed bring certain policy agendas with them. Dr. Lubchenco brought with her a concern and an interest in establishing the cat share system, sort of a cap and trade for fish system and and did get it through with a number of tremendous promises that it would bring uh, not only conservation goals but great wealth and success to our uh, harvesters those those promises have not really been borne out um, but we probably wouldn't have the cat share system because it was very much opposed particularly in the northeast if it hadn't been for the appointment of dr lubchak he very early on went to a council meeting in the state of Connecticut and made it very clear that this was a high priority. Exact quote, she said, I will be watching. Um, so Bob, I'm gonna stop you for a second because I wanna sure. try to get some other things in. But um, so we're talking about personnel changes potentially right. in Washington. Right, when you, uh, that when could you look have at- Come as a result of a change of administration or Congress. The, the head of NOAA is, is obviously a position you would care a lot about. Um, are there other uh, uh, roles that we would want to watch and monitor uh, if uh, we had a, a, a change in the power structure? Well, sure. Um, obviously, the Secretary of Commerce um, and then places, people at the White House, like the Council on Environmental Quality. Um, in the last administration, Christy Goldfuss came from the Center for American Progress, which was created by John Podesta, into the White House, and they were very much involved in the Marine Monument. Effort. Right. So, yeah, there are there are quite quite a number of positions. And one one more thing about about uh, appointments, and then um, we can move on. Is I remember former uh, Congressman Barney Frank, uh, who was uh, chair of the of the uh, often called the Banking Committee, the Financial Services Committee, and Congressman Frank, a uh, prominent liberal Democrat from Massachusetts, used to complain that his problem with uh, with, with financial services was a revolving door between Goldman Sachs and the Treasury. And his problem with uh, fisheries was that the revolving door tended to be from the conservation community into, into NOAA. We don't really see people coming out of the business community and fisheries and going into government service in these, in these appointed positions. Um, Chris Oliver, who's, who's the head of National Marine Fisheries now, who's been excellent um, you know, he came from the uh, being the executive director of the Atlanta Atlanta the Alaska um, Council, and uh, that's a concern. Um, we don't really have either people in industry um, with the willingness or sometimes the academic backgrounds that are required for these appointments. And so we have to be, you know, whoever if President Trump is reelected, I think it's really important to work with the administration and urge. Uh, that, that these appointments be filled by people who understand uh, the industry. And if, um, if, if, Pre if Vice President Biden um, is, is elected, I think it's really important that we work with our coastal Democrats. Uh, many, of the, you know, many, many of our coastal communities are represented by Democrats, and they could hopefully have some influence to temper, you know, to temper the items in the, uh, in the bill that was recently introduced.